Oh, around here it's art. I love the graffiti. Like down down by the train, we we live on the other side of the river, and and I'm always walking down by that down through there just to look at the art, look at the the artists' graffiti. Yeah, it's their work, man. It's awesome. I think it depends on the quality of the work. There's some graffiti that's really, really well done and adds to the community, and there's some graffiti like random tags or covering over storefronts or those sorts of things that's just kind of vandalism. So I guess it really depends. It could be both. I think it's a work of art in the proper place. All graffiti is good as long as it's put in the proper place. Well, it can be an act of, or be uh, art, but uh, sometimes it is vandalism because it's not pretty. How about you? I think it matters whether they've asked for it or not. If it's if it's on purpose, then it can be art, and it's very interesting to look at. But if they start just tagging people's names on there, it's vandalism for sure. Depends on where it's done. If it's done on the side of a building without permission, then it's vandalism. If it's done with permission, then it's art. I would say form of art. Yeah. I mean, I'm an art person, so that's why maybe I am like talking about that. But that's what I think. What do you? What about? How about you? I think people like artists need to be given a space to show what they artistically or creatively want to show, and you know wherever they want to do it. Like even if on a wall, and I've seen a lot of people just gone and visit those places. Like I've been from Austin, and they have like this place where they just have all these graffiti's, and you could see some really good art just on the walls here so definitely I think it's a great piece of art if it's scoped to a particular area or a place where artists can go freely and show what they think or what they visualize and other people can go and enjoy it.